guys, it's Coffee, and today we are back playing The Sims 4 City Living, and I want to go ahead and start today off immediately with the positive comment, which if you don't know what that is, you leave me positivity down below in the comment section, and I select comments before each episode, I suppose, <laughs> and I just find the ones that I think are really inspiring, and I make sure that I put them in the next video. So if you want to be featured, please make sure you leave that positivity down below. This one comes from Lolly Corpse, and she says, positive comment, beauty is found within. And I just thought that was really nice. Short, sweet, simple, to the point. Thank you so much, Lolly, for that comment. Uh, love you, girly. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at where we left off. So it looks like Chuck and Jenny are eating. What are you guys eating? Macaroni and cheese. Sounds good to me. Chuck really needs to use the restroom. It's 1.30... 153 excuse me in the afternoon in game when did they go to work he has work in two days she has work in 21 hours so this is kind of just a chill day i suppose we can have them work on some of their work objectives though which i think would be really helpful let's see what's he doing chat with jenny they do have some money like i really do want to expand their family but i still feel like they're just not ready you know? I don't know, man. We could spend the episode putting together a bedroom. I don't know. I mean, that's kind of part of it. It's We definitely want to have a space that's fit for a child. And currently, we just don't have it. So you know what? Let's go ahead. This is going to be the true test right here, guys. It's going to be, do we have room? Do we have the room in our budget to afford a child. So first and foremost, we're going to delete this entire desk because we just don't need it. That gave us a ton of money back. Um, I really think if Chuck and Jenny have a child, I'm going to cheat and force it to be a girl. <laughs> um, just because I see their first child being a girl, I kind of want them to have maybe two kids and maybe have the second one be a boy. Beehive. What is this? Oh, that's cute. Um... <laughs> What's this? Hmm. Let's look at everything and let's go ahead and actually color sort this by pinks and let's do purples. Let's see what we come up with here. I kind of like this purple with just this light purple with its basic biz new. Oh, we could do, I got it. We could do one wall with this like really fun color and maybe even do the closet, which I assume this is either going to be a closet or it could be a bathroom. We could do this in this fun color. Hold on, let's put the walls up so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, there we go. Just so I can kind of see what I'm doing. So do this in this color and then we could take this light purple that I really like and kind of do the rest of the room up in this. Which I think will look really nice. You know, it's a cute room for a girl. It's got some dimension with the extra wallpaper, but it's not like super crazy. Yeah, I think that'll look really nice. Okay, so we're gonna do kind of a purple styled room. Let's, do we wanna change the flooring? I know I said I was gonna do an actual bedroom next, but I think that this is super fitting and it kind of gives me something to do with the episode while the Sims aren't working. Cause sometimes I feel like when I don't have an actual objective during playtime, it just like, I get bored really easily. So um, this is nice. It's nice to do something like this. <laughs> now let's go ahead and go into lighting. see what we got here this is kind of pretty we could put this in the closet or slash I think it's gonna be a bathroom we're not gonna make it a closet it's gonna be a bathroom and I love these cloud lights but I don't like how far up the ceiling they have to be like I wish they gave us longer options that would have been really nice we could also do some lighting like this if we so chose. Some like really low down lighting or midway lighting or top lighting, depending on how we like that. Those are custom lights though. Um, we could do another one of these over here in the corner, maybe. And then we could do something else right by the bed. So let's go ahead. Let's look at kids stuff real quick. Toddlers. Uh, let's pick out a bed. I actually got these custom, which look how cute these are. Aren't these adorable? Uh, let's cycle through. 
I think I like this one most. So let's go ahead. We'll put her little bed right here and let's grab, what's this? Oh, I don't even think I knew I had that. Cute. It's cute. Uh, let's go ahead. What does this look like in here? What do we got? Oh, do I have blankets that go on this, on toddler beds? Hold on. Oh no. Oh no. This was bad for women. <laughs> um, I don't think these go. Let me control shift C, BB, move objects on. Why does he keep doing that? Hmm. Zero and nine are supposed to. Hmm. Okay. Well, that obviously isn't working. I don't know why. It just doesn't work. So that's a bummer. Nope. We could put some unicorns up if we really wanted to, but I'm not going to do that either. Um, I'm just seeing what's all here, you know. Oh, these little trains. How cute. These curtains would maybe fare nicely. Let's see. We have them in just like a purple color, which is kind of nice. I'd probably put it right there though, and then do another one maybe on the opposing side. You know, just something kind of cute. What? Why is this not straight? Oh, I think it's because these windows are loppy. Hold on, let me, let's grab from here. See, look, we're already down like almost a thousand dollars. I wanted to do the room up like well, if that makes any sense. Like I wanted the room to be a really well put together room. Um, ugh, I hate it that they do this. I wish I could take this window out, but I can't. Mmm. I mean, I could just put another curtain right over it, just like by Felicia, but I don't really like that idea. I think we're going to have to go look at decorations and see what we can see. Maybe just do like a window covering that's kind of like this, like blind style. That's fine. I just kind of wanted to keep the sun off my little baby's face. Okay, let's go ahead and go into surfaces and take a look-see. This is cute. That will work. Just something kind of basic. Why are you so basic, child? Okay, we'll just put that like that. That will be fine. Can I put this like so? Okay, and then we'll add a little lamp. Maybe in for some lighting. I could do one like that. Oh, I like the purple option. That's cute. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. All right, we'll go ahead and we'll grab, hmm. I'm just debating here how else I want to do this. Let's go back to decorations. See, this is why, this is why I never do this for you guys. I never like do builds because I'm all over the place and they're always like super speed builds. Because that's honestly what I'm better at. Um, Actually, let's make it one bigger. Actually, we could even go one bigger than that. Mm. Let's see. Mm. Okay, I think it would have to be more like this, which is fine. I like that. That works. Uh, let's go ahead and actually duplicate this, though. We'll put that one flat and we'll also grab one of these. So we kind of have like a couple right there. That's nice. I got some nice lighting by the bed, which I appreciate. Um, let's also grab maybe like a bookcase of some sort. Storage. This is kind of cute. Or Oh, actually, let's go into kids and look at toys. Let's grab, isn't there a unicorn 
There is queen. Okay, we'll put that in. And then let's also grab a little dollhouse of sorts to put in here. Cause I just think that will be really nice for her to have. Um, and then maybe in storage, we could also do a dresser. This is cute. That's adorable actually. Actually, I think maybe we could have a baby guys. I mean, I keep saying, no, I don't want to do it, but I actually think we probably can afford it. Um, what else did I want in here? I wanted to look at like wall stuff and toys, I think. So yeah, I actually think we can. The only other thing we're really missing is like wall stuff in here and maybe like a plant. <laughs> And we still have like money left over, which is crazy to think about. Oh, these are cute. That would have been nice too. And they, oh no, they don't come in purple. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, we could do something like this on the walls. That's cute. Or even like this. Is there purple? There is purple. We could do this. And then we could also do this. Like just kind of stuff them up there together. Actually, wait, is there different colors? Let's sell that. There are different colors. <gasps> Look at the flowers. That's cute. All right. And then we could have this kind of centered, which it already is. Um, where are those freaking butterfly lights? Here we go. I love these. These are like my fave. We'll just put one above her bed just to add a little more lighting. I'm probably not going to put really anything in here. Maybe if I wanted to add like a tub, that would be nice for her so we could give her baths, you know? Probably just something really simple like this will be fine. I think that actually is really good. The only other thing we're really missing is like a bassinet. Um, Where is the new bassinet? I know we're not having a vampire baby, but it's just too cute to not have, you know? So we will need, guys, I think we, oh, we need a height chair too. Let's see, can we fit it? Yeah, and we still have money left over. We're not super rich, but I think we can actually afford, we can afford to have a baby. So I think we're going to do it, guys. That's what this episode is mainly going to be about then, is us finally consenting to having a kid. I can't believe we were able to do that with the money that we had. It was expensive, but I think we're at the point where we're making enough. We're both home enough. I think we can do it. So we're going to go ahead and have them try for a baby together. Guys, this is so special. This is monumentous for me. I have been putting this off since City Living came out and this series debuted. Like... <laughs> This has been in the back of my mind since, like, this is so massive. Guys, this is huge. And they're both about to get promoted. I feel like this is just, like, the perfect time. I mean, it's not perfect. They're going to struggle a little. But if they're just having one, I think it's going to be all right. Watch them have twins. I'll be livid. I don't have on Leyline on, do I? Let me double check this. I don't. Okay. Just checking. <laughs> Watch them get them anyways. I'll be so mad, guys. Ugh, that would be the worst. All right. We're gonna have to wait and see. All right, Dunyan rings. Let's go ahead and have her take the test. Oh, sorry, Chuck. Chuck's going to be mad because I'm going to go take the bathroom right in front of him. Yep, she's going to beat him to it. Sorry, Chuck, you're going to have to pee your pants. <gasps> she's pregnant! Yes! Girl! I'm so proud. I'm so proud of my babes. 
Okay. Um, I think we're probably actually going to conclude the episode here. I know that makes it a little bit shorter than normal for us, but I really want the next episode to go into them going back to work and kind of focusing on baby prep and saving money. So anyways, guys, I hope that this was exciting for you. I actually think this is going to be, it's going to make me more excited about the series and want to film it more because we're just expanding and I'm just, I'm excited. I'm genuinely excited about this. So anyways, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. Please don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'm at coffee yt and definitely come follow over on twitch where i am just coffee over there the links are always down below for you guys and i'll see you in a future video this is coffee signing off bye guys